sandpaper element to it. Gritty and rough, but that's how you win games. Here's MB following the basket by Larry Bird. It doesn't go for him. Yet yeah, that's another miss for him. They're behind in this game largely because he's shot so poorly. Here's Williams. Offensive rebound. Bird. A beautiful reverse yeah, layup. Yeah, yeah. Bird's got 14 points for the game. They're getting on a roll inside. Their last three field goals have come from the paint. 17 seconds left now here in the second. Williams against Curry. And oh, there's the call on Lou Williams. Lou that is his first foul of the game. Checking in for the away team. Milton with it. With one on the clock. And the quarter ends with some stifling defense right there. And through one half, it hasn't... with the second half upon us. We'll find out if this game becomes the route that it's threatening to be. It's been one outstanding game from Larry Bird. The way he was able to finish on the block was incredible there in that first half. Yeah, you know what? I think he's doing exactly what he has to do. Using his body, shaking off contact, and then finishing at the rim. So with Wiggins sitting on the bench, this is who Frank Vogel is out there. We've got Bird. He's out there with Joel Embiid. Jefferson is out there Joel with Lou Williams. Embiid. And it's Chapman in at the two-guard spot. Yeah, they call him dancing Danny Green, and you can see why. Excellent offensive instincts Joel there. Embiid. Yeah, he, he's shown terrific control of the pace and the rhythm of this offense. You know, numbers don't always tell the story, guys, but his assist totals do paint the picture here. I mean, he's got everybody involved. Now here's Embiid. A shot off that time. Good D by Embiid. Embiid's gotten only two of his eight attempts to fall from the floor. You'd be hard pressed to find someone more confident than Embiid. He's got plenty of confidence, and he's a funny guy, too. Extremely entertaining. He said, the mindset I get when I'm on the floor is that I'm the best player in the gym. Well, much of the time, he ain't wrong. They've shown some strength in the paint today. Their work on the boards has been impressive. Guys, that's putting it mildly. I mean, they've been absolutely dominant. Here's Bird. And it's Philadelphia with the rebound. Embiid's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. From deep green. And that's collected by Bird. Bird's got five rebounds tonight. Just one for four from the field, not the way they wanted to start the second half. You gotta love his hustle, leaving the defense no time to react. And you know you're gonna get those buckets, guys, when you're quick to get out on the break. Get that ball up the court as fast as you can. Now, here's Maxi. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Embiid, the pass to Maxi. Let's a floater go. It's rebounded by Richard Jefferson. Yeah, the offense scuffling a bit to start this second half. Only one for the first five. Count that one. And they've had assists now on their last three baskets. Chapman's gone two of four from the field. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. Maxi passes to Embiid. Shoots over Embiid. Another miss by Philadelphia. Well, they're really making a point of keeping the ball moving around. That's the key. The deep focus on one player. And no matter what anybody tells you, that ball will always move quicker than the defender. Offensively, defensively, they are in total control. And don't leave out the coaching staff here now. I mean, their game plan has been perfect. Now, here's Maxi. Kicks it to Curry. Shot clock at five. Here's Maxi. He gets it in there. Maxi. Maxi's got his first bucket Seth in this one. Curry. The precision passer, Curry, also excellent at seeing his guys when they're open. And Bead with the steal. Here's Curry. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. And the latest wrinkle in Seth Curry's game, creating the 
others with consistency. And he's taking time with his reads, letting the defense commit, then making his move. All part of that maturation process. And Philadelphia making a change here. Andre Drummond's checked in for Embiid. Simmons comes in for Harris. Mark Miles, he's checked in for Danny Green. And it's Shane Milton in for Maxi. And the athleticism that uh, Jefferson possesses is really impressive. Richard a rangy forward who plays with intensity on both ends. Third quarter of basketball here in just a little under three and a half minutes gone by. Pass to Simmons. Bobbed up there for Drummond. And that one goes out of bounds. Last touch by Simmons. And that's just carelessness there. I mean, you have got to have your head in the game. And Murray, here we go. They shoot again. And it's sent back by Drummond. How about that swat by Drummond? Using all of his height and bounce to deny the offense there. And he's been way off the mark this quarter. It's been ugly. Here's Simmons, and Simmons slams it in. And he wanted everybody in the building to feel that ferocity. And we did. Yeah. And we, we felt it. <laughs> Even over here, we felt it. It's the best way to do it, as long as you don't get teed eight. up. And they are attacking the rim and getting great results. And how. I mean, they're taking this defense to task, taking them to school. Every one of their last 10 points have come in the paint. Here's Korkmaz. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. Here's Drummond outside for Curry. Back to Drummond. And Drummond throws it down. Few players get more dunks than Drummond. He's a center who plays like a traditional center, looking to throw it down every chance he gets. Curry against Murray. Here's Korkmaz. Bangs home the trifecta. Korkmaz has got his first three points of the game. Here's Jefferson, and finished off by Jefferson. You know, I really like seeing this from Murray. Looking to get his open teammates involved. Being a willing passer is impressive to his teammates. Here's Korkmaz. Feeds it to Simmons. And it's blocked by Jordan. And as we conclude the third quarter, pretty much a blowout. It's been a one-sided affair. The How about a look at today's State Farm assist of the game? And the definition of teamwork right there, guys. I mean, what great communication between them, and, and what a beautiful feat. For me, next to the big-time alley-oops and monster throwdowns, passes like that are probably the next best thing when it comes to sweet-looking NBA oh. highlights. And with the fourth quarter upon us, time is running out for this game to become competitive. On the court for Philadelphia to start the fourth, we've got Maxi. He's out there with Shake Milton. Matisse Thibel's out there with Andre Drummond. And it's Niang in at the fourth spot. Here's Maxi. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Maxie. And giving up some inches inside, but makes up for it with an aggressive style. Yeah, you know, with that size difference, that's not an easy shot. I mean, I don't care how close to the rim he is, that's a tough shot. Here's Philadelphia. Wiggins with the rebound. This has been a one-sided affair. Yeah, they've done a nice job of extending their lead and maintaining that intensity level. Good on the bucket. When you allow good scores to get uncontested shots at the rim, no wonder you're losing. Yeah, you know, he should be getting extra attention from the defense, not less. Here's Maxi. It's hauled in by Zubats. Maxi's gone two for five tonight. Here's Jefferson, and Jefferson throws it down. An elite score, demonstrating once again how fast he can fill it up. Philadelphia with the ball. Now, here's Maxi. Over Jefferson. No good off the back of the rim. No doubt he's struggling right now from the field. Let's see if he can get it going this morning. And it's Wiggins Andrew. with the jam. And there you go. Monster finish. Wiggins aggressive attacking off the dribble. Here's Maxi. 
They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions right now. They need a basket. Pass to Niang. Six on the shot clock. Let's it go from deep. Wiggins with the rebound. Here's Jefferson going inside. And Jefferson throws it down. Yeah, letting it rip. They're just having fun right now. Yeah, offensively, they've just been rolling. Impossible to stop. Here's Niang, defended by Jefferson. Here's Truman, and the rejection by Zubats. Upside Jefferson. Good for the basket, number nine. He's only missed two shots from the floor all night. Yeah, taking it right into the teeth of the defense, and, and it's a defense that's starting to look frustrated. Well, they should be. I mean, it has not been a good performance for them at that end of the floor. And it's Drummond missing. No matter what looks they get, they just can't convert to stop this run. And, you know, they've got to be careful because this is when the team concept Richard breaks down and guys yeah, start playing hero ball. And, and this offense is in a perfect rhythm, and you can see how they're finishing their plays. Boy, this is borderline ridiculous. I mean, every single attempt finding the bottom of the bucket. Passes it to Thibel. With the teardrop, it's rebounded by Richard Jefferson. They have been really controlling this one. You never want to be complacent on the floor. That's when you lose momentum. Boy, oh, Andrew Wiggins, the former first overall pick, showing off his passing skills there. On the wing, Milton. No good. They had a chance to end the run there. Wiggins passes to Jefferson. That falls. Ice Wiggins feed that time from Wiggins. Wiggins has got four assists in the game. The pass to Milton. To the wing right side. Niang. Another miss by Philadelphia. 105 left here in the fourth quarter. Jefferson attacking. Completely aware of everything around him. Goodrich quick to locate the open man. And uh, 101 left in the fourth. Maxi passes to Niang. Now, here's Maxi. D right on him. Five to shoot. There's the triple. Niang, no good. Now, here's Goodrich. Defended by Feibel. Jefferson's shot is off. Now the 76ers with it. On the wing, Milton. Drummond trying to get himself free. Shade Milton's Milton. shot is good. Wow, what a pass there. He made that a very easy basket with that setup. And the dunk by Zubac. And how about that? What a sensational finish. You, you got to be able to get some hang time to do that one. Yeah, to glide in and That's reverse it home like home. that, so sweet. Nineteen seconds left in the fourth quarter. Maxi passes to Embiid. The nine footers on the mark. Hey, I'll tell you what, Embiid is not just an okay shooter. This guy is a terrific shooter. So you can't let him get comfortable really from any distance. He can knock it down from anywhere. And Frank Vogel wants a timeout. Nice, what's your take? And they've got this one just about wrapped up. Yeah, you know, I'm not sure they needed this time out, quite honestly. Um, perhaps a water break? And now a moment to present the New Balance player of the game, Richard Jefferson. Hey, guys, no doubt who our pick is going to be. Right. He's made everyone else on the court look like they're playing at half speed. It's been total domination, and you can't help but just sit back and admire that performance. He sure has given this crowd a treat tonight. This kind of performance only cements his status as a fan favorite. Yeah, and in every generation or so, a player comes along who can be considered a true superstar. Folks, that's Larry Bird. Here's Joe. And so they get the victory here at home. This game may not have been the...